All you? You're the screw. <laughs> you know what that means to you. Don't, don't you like Kevin's Paisley shirt? It's pretty awesome. He decided to match my guitar. I mean, different color, but. Extend the Christmas spirit to the bright red. I don't know if that's culturally appropriate at this time of the year, but yeah. hey, I'm Jewish. Why do I know? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You do what you do? You can dig it. Uh, so uh, this is a song that I wrote when I was listening uh, to some rap music with my kids and I was listening to the lyrics and the lyrics were like so anti-woman, like very misogynistic and I was like, do you hear those lyrics? And they said, yeah, but I don't care mom, I like the beat. And I'm like, well I care and so I wrote a rapid response. So this is my rapid response to those lyrics. If anyone brought socks, where uh, uh, Alex has taken the socks. And also have, I have QR codes for my album, and so if you take out your phone and put it on uh, picture or taking a picture, the QR code will actually download the album right away from Apple Music or uh, Spotify or all of it. So, for free. Okay. And to get you in the mood for donating, we're going to play a really soft, cuddly, heartwarming song about puppies. Oh no, bye. Such a pleasure. The Land Brothers is leaving the building. <laughs> Only one Land Brother. A land. A land is leaving. <laughs> 
Yeah, yeah, this is a song about a puppy. So, you know, I went away uh, for a weekend, and all of a sudden I get a picture from my son uh, with a puppy in his hand. It just, it turns out that they went to, like, the North Shore Animal League, and they adopted a puppy without me, and they're like, can we keep him? And in a moment of, like, you know, vulnerability, and I was like, oh, okay, we can keep him. And then it was very clear that I was going to be the one taking care of this dog, and that they were going to go away and do whatever they do, and so I decided that I was going to take the puppy back. And I'm, I'm sorry, about, you know, but um, but this is a no-kill shelter, and, and they were probably adopted by a very nice family in Long Island that had a backyard and didn't have to, you know, go up to the eighth floor. So this is about that. You call it Star. Yes. Take you back there. Hot lights. Oh. Cold steel. Not my brown. Oh, thank you. <laughs> thank you. Thank you, baby. I might take a solo, oh. or I might not. <laughs> I don't know. Keep guessing. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
second time. It was busy then, it was like, here we are. That's why we do this live, because we are human. And that's why we're the human element. If you want to perfectly get the album. <coughs> All right. This is, a, this is Lady Jane Grey, uh, which was a story that my friend Jane, who's sitting back there, raise your hand, Jane, told me about, about this queen that was on the throne for uh, nine days, correct? And then, you know, kind of uh, doing her family's bidding, and then somebody overthrew her, and then she was basically taken off the throne and killed. And uh, I was thinking about women, another light subject that we're talking about here. I was thinking about women and the way we're kind of manipulated um, in society. Uh, and I had a patient that came in once and she uh, was on methamphetamine. She was homeless, homeless and uh, was in the foster care system for a long time. And she met this guy who was manipulating her and she ended up um, being on... What? Losing her head. <laughs> yeah, losing her head, so to speak. So there was parallels between these two stories, uh, between that woman and um, the woman that I know. I know, life so <laughs> Oh, 
everybody from different parts of my life and totally beloved so I'm glad that you get to be together. Yeah. Oh my god. I mean how lucky am I to be able to get a group of people together, you know, to hang out, listen to music and eat and know each other and hear things. So thank you all for coming. Happy birthday. Thank you. Happy awesome. Birthday. So glad I was born. Thank you. So this is our last song of the night. I'm glad that you came and I'm gonna spend this time introducing the band. Well, I think we've all met each other. That's fun. Oh, yeah, Kevin, hi, nice to meet you. Yeah, Kevin, Erica, Erica, Kevin, Damien, I don't think you've met Erica before. You haven't met Erica. Jamie never came. Jamie. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm gonna take what? No, I'll, I'll I'll introduce the band. That's my job. I mean, you were whispering or mumbling or something. I don't know what I was mumbling. <laughs> I just want somebody to play. Go ahead. You, 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 play, you play that little riff going. Okay. So, on my left here, the lovely, wonderful, talented, my really, really good friend, Erica Smith. <laughs> and I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go way back there. Sorry, I should've kept going forward. On the, every instrument you could possibly imagine, I don't know how many things are in that bag of trips. Tricks, Baba Sima. <laughs> My guitar, one who is uh, who's pushing me to get bigger, better, stronger, bigger, badder. 
Doug Murphy. And behind me on uh, drums, the wonderful, the talented. I used to play with him. How many years ago was it? Ten or twelve years ago in a pretenders band together, uh, Damien Dieterman. And to my right here, kind of a solid, hold it down, bass man. Love him, love him and Paisley. Kevin Roy. Thank you.